Welcome to Sammy Skimp Bob's Almost Always Limited episode number five. Following on from episode four where Sammy dropped off from E Acres in Ramsey. He's been lucky enough to pick up a, a job from the company going to Decatrans in Belfast. He's going to take a trailer full of containerized trees. 143 kilometers, which of 45 is driven, and 98 kilometers is on the ferry. And he's going to get paid 43 euros because this is a reality mode where the payments are a lot less than what you would get paid if you were playing normally on your Euro Truck Simulator. So we are just going to come into Douglas, where we are going to pick the ferry up. Uh, I don't know how much it's going to cost for this ferry over to Ireland but at least we are not paying for it and the firm that have hired us are paying for On a little side note, if you're new to this channel don't forget to hit that red subscribe button hit the bell notification for any further videos that will be released in the near future and give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, I will reply to your comments whether they are good or bad. Well the ferry port is just ahead, as you can see, uh, we'll drive up there and we'll park the truck up. I'm going to guarantee that it's cost this company a lot more this ferry trip than it has of what they're paying us in wages. 350 euros, but I guess that goes down to the size of the vehicle and the weight of the vehicle rather than the passengers. So good news for Sammy is that he has recently re kindled his relationship with Fat Sam. He's deleted his profile off plenty of flab and he's taken the app out of his phone so love is in the air again. Go oh, Sammy boy. Well I guess this rekindling of the romance was down to Sammy's bout of Carlisle virus where Fat Sam visited him on numerous occasions up in Carlisle Infirmary. We asked her while she was there who'd had her children while she spent time in Carlisle and she replied Our Mackenzie is looking after our Levi, Mercedes and Porsche. He's 15 you know. I just do the social series don't find out. They laugh. It's understandable that Fat Sam really does have a deep voice because she is a butch lady. She really does have a face that would frighten police horses. At Liverpool Everton games, they call her for crowd dispersal. So we further questioned Sam and we said, What would happen if the social services found out? And she replied, The kids would go to their dad's Dippy Frank, or he would be taken into care. So if anybody from Liverpool Social Services is watching, it's all on the hush hush eight. So whilst Sammy was suffering with Carlisle virus, um, his parents, Cyril and Pamela, were also there at the hospital. We asked them to appear on camera, but they would not appear on camera. But they've given us a little statement about Sammy and his rekindling of his relationship with Fat Sam. And they say, and I quote, We know how Sandra has been with Samuel in the past when she threw him out on the streets again. We are not happy that he's gone back to her, but what can we do about it? He is a grown man who is making his own way in the world and he makes his own decisions. Samuel knows that if it happens again, we are only at the end of the phone and his room is always available. We feel when he had some money, she was all over him like a tramp on chips. But as soon as the money went, she didn't want to know and it didn't take long for her to throw him away like a used tissue. We feel that she's only got back with him because she has had a benefit sanctioned and he has a few of in the bank because he is working. Will she dump him again when the money dries up? We only hope she doesn't, but only time will tell. I think there's a few um, harsh words to be said there. Uh, I don't think Sammy's parents are very fond of Sam and they're not very complimentary of her. We're not too far away now from the drop-off at Decatrans. Uh, just 
Sammy drive into the yard and then we'll let him pass where they want this trailer for him. So we've got to go around the back, he's got to reverse this trailer into bay number three. Uh, we'll step out of the cab, we'll leave camera rolling and we'll let Sammy do his work. That's a thumbs up from Sammy. He's parked it and he took his time parking it, but he's brand new to the job. He's brand new to reversing in tight spaces. At least he's done it. Thank you all for joining in and watching. And he wants you to join in the next episode, which is episode six. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Yeah.